Good morning. It's Monday, August the 31st today. Let my mouth be full of your praise and your glory all the day long. Your word is a lantern to my feet and a light upon my path. O oh God, you have taught me since I was young, and to this day I tell of your wonderful works. This is the Lord's doing, and it is marvelous in our eyes. Jesus taught us, saying, For if you forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive men their trespasses, neither will your Father forgive you. This is the Lord's doing, and it is marvelous in our eyes. The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament shows his handiwork. One day tells its tale to another, and one night imparts knowledge to another. Although they have no words or language, and their voices are not heard, their sound has gone out into all lands, and their message to the ends of the world. In the deep has he set a pavilion for the sun. It comes forth like a bridegroom out of his chamber. It rejoices like a champion to run its course. It goes forth from the uttermost edge of the heavens and runs about to the end of it again. Nothing is hidden from its burning heat. This is the Lord's doing, and it is marvelous in our eyes. Glory be to the Father, glory be to the Son, glory be to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Lord of all power and might, the author and giver of all good things. Graft in my heart the love of your name. Increase in me true religion. Nourish me with all goodness and bring forth in me the fruit of good works through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Lord God, Almighty and Everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose, through Jesus Christ my Lord. Amen. May God bless you today and always.